from being raised in a common family in Bihar to his penance during our freedom struggle to becoming our nation's first president nobody can forget beloved rajendra babu's contributions to the nation nobody can forget his contributions in the framing of our constitution when it came to drafting the constitution rajendra babu was elected as the president of the constituent assembly a reflection of his immense abilities under the guidance of mahatma gandhi and having stood alongside pandit nehru and sardar patel in the battle for our freedom Rajendra Babu understood the needs of an independent India. He understood how the constitution of an independent India should have been drafted, and this is exactly why he was given the responsibility of heading the constituent assembly. A responsibility he fulfilled amazingly with the experience of being the president of the Congress party three times. During a discussion in the constituent assembly, Rajendra Babu said about the future challenges that after all, a constitution like a machine is a lifeless thing it acquires life because of the people who control it and operate it and india needs today nothing more than a set of honest people who will have the interest of the country before them not only this when india's foundational value of unity and diversity was challenged in the constituent assembly he said we have communal differences caste differences linguistic differences provincial differences and so forth It requires people of strong character, people with vision, people who will not sacrifice the larger interests of the country for the sake of smaller groups and areas and who will rise above the prejudices which are born of these differences. These concerns raised by Rajendra Babu haunt our country even today. But if we let these issues win, then they will have defeated Rajendra Babu and as a nation we cannot allow this to happen. Jai Hind.